A mother and her two sons face charges of growing marijuana. Kimberly Cody and Maximilian Hacker are in the Madison County Jail at this hour. News 13 Cheryl Barber is live at the home in Mars Hill where everything started. Cheryl, they say deputies removed evidence this morning. Yes, they've uh, estimated that there's about 200 pot plants in this house on Tilson Street. Shortly after midnight this morning, Mars Hill Police and Madison County Sheriff's deputies raided the house. They arrested Kimberly Hacker, but her two sons tried to run away. Officers had surrounded the house, and they were caught before they could leave the property. They say Kimberly's two grandchildren uh, were also in the home and put in DSS custody. They say the entire house was involved in the marijuana growing operation. We have uh, um, marijuana growing basically in every room, some type of chemical uh, in every room of the residence upstairs and downstairs as well. We've got plants from uh, two inches tall to four foot tall. Here's a look at some of those plants that they brought out getting ready to put into a large truck and haul off. Sheriff Hardwood said some of the pot was ready for harvest. Kimberly Hacker faces felony charges of trafficking, manufacture, and possession of marijuana. She's also charged with misdemeanor child abuse because of her two grandchildren present in the home. Her sons are in their 20s and are charged with trafficking, possession, and using a house to grow pot. Now, Kimberly is in jail on a $103,000 bond. Her two sons have $102,000 bonds each. Deputies are moving the pot and equipment to a storage facility. And coming up on News 13 at 1230, what neighbors say about what they saw going on next door. Reporting live in Mars Hill, I'm Cheryl Barber, News 13.